Check it out guys, I am back and I got a brand new song here from the OG called Mikey D. So I'm saying guys, real OG bars we're gonna be getting tonight guys. Mikey D right here got a track with DJ Rob Swift, the legendary Rob Swift from The Executioners guys, so I'm saying. And the track is called Over 50 man, produced by the legendary Dr. Butcher. So I'm saying the infamous Dr. Butcher guys and the track is nice. I like it guys. I'm saying I'm talking straight OG bars right here from a rapper who's over 50 and the name of the song is over 50 by the way. So I'm saying I don't want to say this. My kid D, I need an over 50 t-shirt man. I'm 55 and I'm still crushing these suckers like back in the day like you said on here. You see what I'm saying now? The track is dope, guys. I love it. My salute to Rob Swift. My Rob Swift on the cuts. All my scratch nerds watching me right now. I know you guys are going to be listening just to hear what Rob Swift is doing on the turntables, man. He's cutting it up real nice on here, see what I'm saying? But it's all about the bars right now, see what I'm saying? Once again, salute to Mikey D with the bars, man. Now, I love this right here, and I love the fact that the track is called Over 50. He's over 50, guys, and he's proud of it, and he's still spitting bars, see what I'm saying? And it's real dope, see what I'm saying? And I'm calling on all the old G's right now. All the old G's, trust me when I tell you, all the old G's and all my old heads, you need to be coming back with some music. Today I was here and I heard my daughters playing Biggie and Nas. My daughter is 17, so I'm saying, and she's like, I don't like the new rappers, daddy. They're boring, so I'm saying, I like this stuff. And I didn't even know she knew about Biggie, even though her dad is a DJ and I have all the records here. But they usually didn't mess with my stuff. They don't even look at them because they're from the new generation, guys. So I'm saying, but I heard my daughters listening to Biggie and Nas. So I'm saying, so if they are listening to Biggie and Nas and they are the, the, the perfect example of what this new generation is, and they are telling me that the new rappers, a lot of them suck, they don't like the music, so I'm saying, and they are gravitating to what came before, which is the OGs from the 90s, and even some of the 80s stuff, because they like Run DMC as well. I was surprised to see them playing Walk This Way. So I'm telling all my OGs, if you need to get in the booth, you need to be dropping some music, so I'm saying, get your shit out, because these kids are going back to the classics because they're fed up with some of the stuff that's out now in fact they're fed up with a lot of the stuff that's out now and they are seeing the magic and the beauty in what came before and they are learning to appreciate it now a lot of these kids are buying vinyl they're buying cassettes they've never seen vinyl they've never seen cassettes and they are curious and they are spending their money to find out what happened before their time and why is it so dope see what i'm saying now let me get to the bars man I'm talking too long here let me get to the bars Mikey D goes in, and I want you guys to listen to what Mikey D said on here. Check this out. Mikey D said this right here. Credit score 800, these young rappers stay blunted. I'm high off of life, so I stay away from it. Got a rhyme and rebuttal for everything that they come with. My crime is in a huddle just in case they really want it. See what I'm saying, guys? I'm fly as a bird, and I am the illest rapper I ever heard. Over 50 and I'm acting my age and still crushing these suckers like back in the day. You see what I'm saying? No, that is bars right here from an OG telling these young kids over 50 and I'm acting my age and still crushing these suckers like back in the day. You see what I'm saying? No, straight bars once again. Salute to Mikey D, man. This is bars. I love it, guys. The track is called Over 50 and then Rob Swift. Killing it with the cuts on you, so all my scratch nerds, all the DJs who are coming here to see what Rob Swift is doing, he's killing it with the cuts, and I'm saying on this, and as I said, the track is produced by the infamous Dr. Butcher, who inspired Rob Swift to become a DJ back in the day, so I'm saying, guys, so trust me when I tell you, this guy right here who produced the track is definitely an icon in the game, a dope DJ as well, but also a dope producer now, so I'm saying, and once again, man, the track over 50 guys, if you want to hear it, guess what, I got the hookup, the link, is down in the description for you to go check it out absolutely free courtesy of Mikey D, Rob Swift, Dr. Butcher and YouTube Music and I want you guys to go listen and just go listen and learn, see what I'm saying? Go learn to appreciate what the OGs did and see how dope they still are, see what I'm saying? And as I said, these kids are turning, they are turning away from the music that's out. My daughters tell me the real OGs from their time that they like are all dead, see what I'm saying? The dope rappers that came from their era 
are gone. So I'm saying, guys, so I'm telling you right now, all these young rappers here, if you ain't Kendrick Lamar, you better get to the drawing board and start reinventing your shit. Because trust me when I tell you, these kids are turning away from your music. They're saying that the great ones are gone. The XX and Tentacion, the Juice World, so I'm saying, the Mac Miller, so I'm saying, Pop Smoke, those are gone. And they are not liking what a lot of you are doing now who are still alive, so I'm saying. So I'm telling you right now, man, these kids are turning back to the 90s. They were appreciating the OGs more. That's why so many OGs are coming out of the woodwork. So guess what? Get your shit together and start spitting bars, see what I'm saying? Go study Kendrick. He's the leader of this new generation right here. He's crowned King Kendrick for a reason. Go study him, go learn from him, and step your game up, see what I'm saying? Because you're losing your audience to the OGs who came before, see what I'm saying? So with that said, I'm going to wrap it up, man, see what I'm saying? I'm going to wrap it up right here. Brand new people, if this is your first time here, welcome to DJ Pablo TV, all right? Before you go check out the song, make sure you hit the subscribe button right here and turn the notification bell on that way you don't miss any of my videos, all right? My DJs go find this, go put this in the mix. The demand is building for real hip-hop, real spitters, real bars. Kids are getting tired of the mumble stuff. Rappers will spit bars that they cannot understand. If they can't recite your song, then it's not good enough. They should be able to listen to you, hear the words, and can recite it like some of the classics that came before your time. If your music is not fitting that mold, then you will be forgotten. So I'm saying, so I'm telling you right now, DJs go put it in the mix, feed people the real hip-hop. Young rappers, if you're not writing clarity, go back to the drawing board. Make your bars better, so I'm saying. Fix what you are doing. Study Kendrick Lamar and you will learn. See what I'm saying? And my regular subscribers, I salute you guys for always being here with me, man. And with that said, we're going to wrap it up the usual way by saying peace and salute from West Palm Beach. And I'm out of here. And I'll see you guys on my next video. All right? Peace.